All caution see favorite reflection of you. We be out here. Woo! I love it. One of my favorite spots of hiking in the Montclair area, Eagle Rock Reservation. And we just finished up a little yoga hike with an amazing, amazing meditation at the end. But whether the meditation was amazing, whether it was unamazing, whatever it was, it simply was, you know? Right now we're in the present moment talking about our experience as we walk to the car. Lots going on with the new business, Society of the Rising Suns. Interesting because I'm feeling a lot closer to where I want to be, if that makes sense. I don't know. I'm at a place where I wouldn't say I'm content, rather excited about the place I'm in. Noticing how much progress it's taken to get to this place and noticing how much further I've got to go. And at the same time, it's so much fun, dude. It is so much fun. Each and every single day, every single moment, there's no ordinary moments in this life. And so every single little aspect of, whether it be this hike, um, working through the business and interacting with some people um, that have been helping me build it, or meeting beautiful women out on the streets. There's no moment I've taken to be ordinary. And I love that because, man, it just leads for such a much more enriching life and a life that's, whoo, I love. watching The Last Samurai for the first time starring Tom Cruise the other night and there was this concept that was spoken about and I believe it was an allusion or a reference to The Book of Five Rings by Miyamoto Musashi, the greatest samurai warrior in Japan <coughs> but it was this concept that one must fight with no mind to be most effective in the art of fighting. And I'm obviously paraphrasing, but this concept of no mind is really, really fascinating to me. For those who've meditated before or done yoga, some type of practice like this, there are moments of no mind. And it's such a peaceful place. in time to be. It feels endless and yet at the same time fleeting. And in those moments, I truly believe anything is possible. Even crossing this mud over here. But as I continue to study and really practice, I'd say more importantly, business, I'm recognizing the importance of it to be truly effective with one's time. In other words, without the idea or without having the mind running and racing millions of miles an hour, or without having the mind thinking about this, 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 Rather, focusing all of that attention, mental attention, on one task or one area. Things that seem insurmountable or tough to overcome, difficult to do, become effortless.
keep up, thrive, and stay sexy.